Yo, yo. We are back, man. Monday, Halloween today. Happy Halloween, everyone. Uh, no costume for me. I don't really like dressing up too much. I do like Halloween and the whole theme and everything, though. Dressing up, though, not for me. Um, but yeah, we are going to continue and finish Prey, dude. Uh, got a little frustrated last time I played this. Hopefully... We can figure out how to lure out Dahl. He, uh, we're at the command shuttle. I have no idea how to get him out of here. Um, we are going for a certain ending. So there's... There's three endings, but there's multiple ways to do some of the endings. I think we're going to inca incapacitate Dahl. We might do both endings, actually. Might just show it on stream. Um, let me get this cord out. Holy fuck. Um, we might inc incapacitate Dull, and then we can, like, extract Neuromods out of him, and then we can convince him to fly us the fuck out of here on the shuttle that he came in on. Or we can blow up the whole station. Th those are the two endings I think I'm going to do and see what happens. Um, but first one, we're gonna try to get Dull out. We gotta stun him, but not kill him. And, uh... Yeah, extract Neuromods out of him. I think that is the play. All right, I was here. I, I had to touch this thing, right? Well, we can't zoom in in this game. I, there's a panel right in front of me. I got like... Yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna be some bullshit here. Again, I don't know how you're supposed to, like, get in here normally. There might be a computer somewhere or something to make this go closer to that. I don't know. But there's gotta be a way to, like... We just fall off of this shit so easily. So fucking easily. Maybe I can just hit it? It like launched me forward. The fuck was that? I need to hit X on that shit. I hit it. Oh, I even climbed on this. Okay, that's a quick save. Kidding me? We are in the shuttle, dude. He's not here. Take a narrow mod. Get drunk as fuck inside his shuttle. <clears throat> Commander Doll, this is William Yu, acting chairman of the Trans Star Board of Directors. I will need your credentials to authorize this mission. Of course. My authentication sign is Zeta Invictus Emperor Tangerine. Sign checks out. Good morning, Director Yu. Shuttle is hot and holding orbit. Awaiting mission parameters. You must secure every piece of Cobalt Clearance Level technology and research aboard Talos-1. Then eliminate all Transtar personnel. All personnel. No survivors. It's your show. Damn. And their funeral. Payment will be deposited into six separate Benelux accounts after you transmit evidence of success. I leave my operator feeds on. Just keep watching. We strongly advise deploying your technical officer to a station router inside the firewalls first. Ideal location would be the station exterior, near the power plant grids. Yes, I've seen the schematics, Mr. Yu. Goodbye. You will destroy this transmission after... Damn. He was hiding somewhere in the exterior. God, outside? 
All right, well, finally got in there. Again, there has to be, like, some type of bridge or something that's supposed to... Or maybe a lift that would lower this. Would it be down here or some shit? Not seeing much. I don't know, whatever. Hopefully we don't have to go back in there. I saw they had a cargo hold. Yeah, we, we moved so fast, holy shit. I don't need the alcohol shit. Okay. I guess go find the tech officer shit. Let's do it. But yeah, hopefully we'll have enough time to do both endings today. I think there's a point you can do either or. Well, I have saves as well. I don't want to fight that thing. I'm good. Problems. Your workmates hiding in the cargo bay are going to suffocate in a few minutes. Oh shit. Maybe you can save them, but you'll have to come out of the walls, rat. Life support. The clock is ticking. Oh man, 15 minutes. Morgan. Dal's cut off oxygen to the cargo bay. There's nothing I can do from here and none of the doors are responding. Atmosphere controls are in life support. If you can help, do it quick. Or this is the last time we'll be talking. Miss Elazar is right to be alarmed, though her assessment is mistaken. Dahl is ma manipulating the oxygen and nitrogen mixture. With nitrogen flooding into the atmosphere, anyone in the cargo bay will asphyxiate far more quickly than they simply here. cut the oxygen. I suspect they'd already be dead if Dahl weren't trying to use them to manipulate you. Doors are working again, Morgan. Nice work. I'm taking what's left of my crew to the atmosphere controls in life support. We're going to clear out Dal's shit can operators and make sure there are no more mishaps with the air on this station. That would be nice to, uh... Dal populated his entire crew with customized operators. He made the mistake of hanging his hopes in a machine. Flesh and blood is messy, Morgan, but it's the only thing that matters in the end. Well done. The upload just kicked in. Meet me in the operator. We have important work to do. Uh, do we live? Here we go. Yeah, Alex wants me to meet with him now. I feel like I'm doing two different things at once, honestly. <clears throat> Trying to reload my gun. Hello? Morgan, Dahl is breathing down my neck. I don't know how much longer. Shit. Whoops. I, I didn't mean to do that. Sim lab secure. Well, except for Igwe. But he'll be up all night. Speaking. Commander. Cool, there's a way to stop that. Okay. So we're... Repo man. Okay.
Protect Alex from doll. Stop doll before you hack way into the... Okay, so... Maybe we'll incapacitate him there. Stop doll. Okay. Wrong button. Dude. Further instructions? Do I have to like leave and come back? Will he come get this body or what? Okay, hold on. Make a manual save here. What if I go in? Oh, there he was. I promised you my arming cape. All I ask is you hear me out first. And you can blow towel. Just one to pieces if that's what you want. Damn, he is tanky as shit. Dude, do the fucking Q beam. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Just kill him, nothing happens. Oh. You need to get down to the nearest clinic. Once that's done, I'll arrange transport with the medical operator. Here we are. Hopefully you'll never have to listen to this recording. But recording because I killed him. Then something. Unfortunates happened to me. I suspect you've seen enough by now to abandon the notion of destroying Talos One. I've always been the one who thought we couldn't be trusted to play with fire without burning the house down. But you convinced me that we could do anything we imagined. No matter how ridiculous. I hope you still believe that. If not, then I'm glad I died before seeing my brother succumb to pessimism. We have the data to confirm what you suspected. The coral is broadcasting a neural signal. A secret message reaching out to the stars. What I want to know is what is the message? And who is listening to it? I have a feeling you already know. I'm carrying a fabrication plan for the prototype no wave device you can see. Make one, then place it at the heart of the coral. We will hijack the coral signal and use it to deliver a massive shock to every Typhon organism at once. Good luck, Morgan. I just regret. I won't be at your side to see it happen. Okay, I don't want to kill him. I just wanted to see what happened. <laughs> um, yeah. Man, they really give you free reign to do what you want most of the time. So you want me to get Dahl to a medical bay or something? I think it was down here.
not where I want to go. Where is that at? It's below me, but like where? Maybe to the right. Oh, of course. Scan complete. New psionic aptitude available. I have to like wait and come back. I'm gonna put you right here. Maybe we have to like, cause he he hasn't told me anything, right? No. Do I do I have to like talk to Alex first? The whole time Alex was hiding right here, huh? I wonder if this was always visible or not. Okay, I guess we'll talk to him. I promised you my arming cape. All I ask is you hear me out first. And you can blow Talos one to pieces if that's what you think is best. I don't think you'll do it. I know. Because I used to think we couldn't be trusted to play with fire without burning the house down. But you convinced me. You showed me anything was possible, even if the price was steep. That part of you is still in there. We can make history, Morgan. Not those leeches on the Transtar board of directors, not Mom and Dad. You and I. Just like we planned. We've got the data to confirm what you suspected. And Carl is broadcasting a neural signal. A secret message reaching to the stars. Uh -huh. What I want to know is what is the message? And who is listening to it? I think you know. Ever since we first tested the Typhon neuromods, you've known. This fabrication plan is for the null wave device prototype. You can that see. That hurt me. What the fuck? It will hijack the coral signal and use it to deliver a massive shock to every Typhon organism at once. Take it. And the army key, like I pro. What? Morgan! Uh. Well, that's great. Okay, so that's what happened. <laughs> Alex, you good? He's unconscious. Morgan, we're in life support now. It's all clear. Air's normal across the board. I lost some good people fighting the black boxes. And Dal wasn't here. If you see him before I do, make him pay. Elazar out. So no matter what, he just passes out? That's so weird. Whoa. What? You need 
need to get Dow to the nearest clinic. Once that's done, I'll arrange transport with the medical operator. Get to Alex before he dies. Okay, what am I doing with Alex? There's so much shit going on at once. Perdition. Use Alex in his safe, or put Alex in a safe room. What safe room, this? Well, hold on, let me loot real quick. What you got in here? This is my transcript. I'm gonna listen to this. Running checks. Sim lab secure. Well, except for Igwey, but he'll be up all night. Speaking this of is not up, the right one, the is it? Of his daughter Maya, but that's not his daughter. It's his wife. Are you kidding me? No, she died. Well, when Igwe was younger, it's in his records. Christ, you've seen his records? Yeah, during the security check. Okay. Okay, so my voice is obviously familiar. Probably sound more tired than usual. It's been never ending, setting up the rooms and protocols to test the new mods. The risk is substantial, but if we succeed, copying neural networks from the Typhon onto human minds is gonna change everything, so. Oh, fuck. That creature is still trying to consume the station, and I've picked up multiple hull breaches. I believe in you, Morgan. Make this count. Morgan. Thank you for what you did. He just woke up immediately. <laughs> you could have left me to die. Where's Del at? Oh. It's more important than ever now that we finish this the white way. Take care of the no wave device. I'll head for the bridge as soon as I catch my breath. Assuming Del is coming with me right now. Oh, sorry, doll. You're getting fucked up. There you go. Heal me. Transfer pyramid. Clear as zero medical class operator ready to deploy. Please stand clear of our diagnosing. Looks like you've had a rough day. Try to relax. Hold up. Please fill out a patient experience questionnaire so I can serve you better next time. Okay, well doll safe. Feel like this is a good quick well we could make a manual save. So I think from here we can do either um, ending. One blowing up the whole place and the other, uh, saving Dawn, escaping on his shuttle. Fabricate? Okay. Oh, it doesn't tell me where the fabricator is. I know there's one close. Towards guts. Such a crazy game, man.
like passing through me. Yeah, say we could scan this earlier. Scan complete. More specimens required. I want to scan all three. We can. Oh, it's hurting me. Ow. Alright, quit fucking me up, man. Let me just scan your bitch ass. Last one. Research complete. Okay. Anyways, so how do we get to guts? That's where I was before, shit. So it's over by the greenhouse, all right. Leave me the fuck alone, dude. Jesus. Okay, this is where I want to go. Oh, they don't work. Son of a bitch. Shit, man. I don't want to go to guts. At six neuromods. one lobby. God, this map is so fucking confusing, man. I mean, does this help me? Can I, like, go around or some shit? Fuck, man. Destroy the station, just as you planned. 
The blast will take the monster down with it. Destroy the station? But didn't you hear him? The null way. Alex is correct. It could work and preserve what we have learned here. We have to try. Igwe, look at the alien outside the station. Of course it's a risk, but we've seen the generator work. To destroy all this, to murder a species, and the research lost. It's... January is right, Morgan. We can't let these things get back to Earth, even if one of them hit Earthside. Morgan, please. Destroying the station should be the last option, not the first. Dr. Yu, Dr. Igwe, we have the subject, Dal, and his life signs are stable. Thank you. We are prepping him in the Neuromod division now. Come as soon as you can. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's get out of guts, I guess. Fuck. The map layout's kind of frustrating in this game. And loading screens definitely don't help. Come on. Microgravity detected. If the idea hasn't occurred to you, I'm sure it will eventually. Don't do it. I can't predict what would happen if you scan the apex, but all my models point to suffering. Yeah, I'm going here. Hopefully the uh, elevator still works. I feel like this shouldn't take as long to load, especially on like hardware that's way better than the PS4. Okay, cool. We're not in zero gravity anymore. It said Neuromod Division. <clears throat> Come on, boys, quit fucking up. To reserve a slot. Okay, we want to go for lobby. All right. Oh, there might be enemies in here, man. Jesus, look at that. Yo, close the fucking door. Okay. So, where are we going? I gotta get, get to my office for a fabricator, I think. Please don't be an alien here. Okay. Privet Morgan. What up? What up? Uh, get rid of all these. a good amount of everything in the original contained cylinder placing the null wave device there 
We'll override the entire coral network with our own signal. Use your cyclescope to locate the exact spot. Okay, I think here's where we make a manual save. And we could do either uh, ending. Um, let's do... Let's do doll first. Okay, second floor. Oh my god, how the fuck did we get in there? I hate how this game is laid out, man. I can't stand it. Anytime I want to go anywhere, there's always like some crazy fucking way to get in. Never just simple. Like, dude, uh, how the fuck? The stairs? We can't use the stairs. Oh my god, we have to do this stupid leverage dog shit. There's no way to get in. Jesus, man. Is there anything in here? It's leverage one. Okay. the only way to get in oh my god come on man there we go thank god wait Yep, that was literally the only way to get in. So if you didn't have leverage one, what do you do? I mean, is there like a way to glitch it out with a glue gun? I can't imagine anything else. Here. Dr. Yu, Morgan. I was afraid you wouldn't make it. The subject, doll, has been secured. I believe uh -huh. I've isolated the correct neuromod. It is essential we say as little as possible of what has happened on the station and focus on the situation. Doll, memory serves, should resort to field training and react accordingly. He was never one to question orders. Any when you are, Morgan. Remember, if this works, say nothing. Alright. What? Who are you? Morgan? Your father's been asking about you and Alex I was supposed to report to him about her retrieval after modding up where am I why am I restrained he doesn't Commander. know Do, I am Dr. Igwe chief physician here you've I've seen your face in the company directory Alex's pet the discredited parapsychologist ah 
Commander Dahl, you like, suffered ah. a severe head injury as a result of a crisis here on the station. We need to evacuate at once. Hello. But Are you we, here for an we couldn't leave without you. Are you able to pilot a shuttle? What? Yes, of course I can pilot. Wait, what emergency? Is this Argus installation? Where's Casper? I'm afraid there's no time to explain. We need to get to the shuttle bay and prepare for departure. Transtar mandate. Doctor, you can confirm. Of course. Morgan, you look like shit. <laughs> All right. Not Let's wrong. get Daddy's precious child off the station. Transtar will black box me. Just need to check your vitals. Wouldn't want our pilot to faint. There's nothing wrong with me. Lead the way, Morgan. We'll catch up. Alright, what, what if I do this? What if I hit him? Ooh. Ah. It's by design that I can predict what you're going to do fairly often. And yet, this turn of events with Dahl... I'm impressed and surprised you've managed to find a way to get the remaining crew off the station. Please! Please, Morgan! <laughs> He's like, what the fuck? <laughs> I like how there's just, like, nothing. <laughs> just nothing said. No. Oh. Alright. Damn, he, he I almost killed Dahl with uh, one wrench hit. Alright. It's by design that I can predict what you're going to do fairly often. And yet, this turn of events with Dahl. I'm impressed and surprised you've managed to find a way to get remaining crew off the station. Blah blah blah. <sighs> All right, get the hell out of here, man. I can't believe what a crazy ending for this. Where was the shuttle at, actually? I think he was at the uh, arboretum or whatever, right? believe it, it connected to this hopefully microgravity detected Okay, we're going to... The bridge, right? Is it the bridge? Let's see. Come on. Come on. Fuck off with your stupid shit, man. Oh, wait. I don't need to go in here. Yeah, 
can't remember if this is where the shuttle is. No, it's Shuttle Bay, isn't it? How do we get to Shuttle Bay? From the lobby? Really? Let me just make sure. I'm really bad with maps and shit, dude. Like, I hate when we have to wait for something to tell me where it is. Like, why is there not a waypoint right now telling me where the shuttle is? make any sense Morgan, Igwe, what's the update on our patient commander Dahl is making a speedy recovery and we are making our way to the shuttle bay I have informed him of the threat to the station and... fine Morgan I'll meet you in the shuttle bay okay Alright, so we went the wrong way. Son of a bitch. What if I should just load my save when I was at the lobby? Let's do that, because I hate... Ugh, it takes so long to navigate in zero gravity. But do I have to go do something else? Vital signs critical. So where is the shuttle bay from the lobby? Which floor? I hate that glitch. If you hit it too fast, it's dark. Oh, it's so fucking stupid. Um. Oh, at the bottom. Okay. I see. I think this is it. I think we just board it and we leave, right? If everyone's here. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Did everyone die? God, last Vital second, signs. fuck you. Shit. 
Shoot it. Oh my god, get the gun out, you stupid fuck. Jesus, dude. Oh my god, I gotta make this jump again. No way. No way. Oh, thank God. Wait. Where are they? Huh? No one's here. Wait for Doll to contact you. Do I literally have to leave? Man, come on, devs. What is this shit? Oh my god. Do I just have to leave and stand around? I hate I hate missions that make you wait in any Bethesda game or any game in general, dude. Like let's wrap it up, man. I even went the wrong way entirely. Bro. What are we doing, man? 19 What? Am I, am I just... Morgan, I'll meet you in the shuttle bay. And literally no one's here. Devs, devs, devs. Alright, let's go in some random room. I guess... It's so dumb. It's even down here. Yeah, there is like no reason why you should be here. Bro, what is going on? Like, get to the fucking shuttle, man. Get in here, did I? I'm 
I'm about to look it up. Like, bro, get to the shuttle so we can leave. What is this dog shit? What are we? I don't think it's timed. Is it just like loading screen based? It's been so long. Oh my god, they're still not there. Are they dead? Did they die from the phantoms? Oh, Christ. Hold on, let me look this shit up. Nothing's happening. You have to initiate the self-destruct to even do the ending. Oh my god, that's so lame. Jesus. Okay. Well, I guess we gotta go through with it then. Where is the power plant? Through life support? That's so stupid. <laughs> Why do you have to initiate the self-destruct first? Because Dr. Igwe was like, yeah, hey, let's just escape on the shuttle and not destroy the shit because to reserve the, uh, the research. I guess you have to do the null wave thing. Hmm. Morgan, I don't know if you've seen... But there is alien matter ripping through the hull. You have to move. Boy, boy. Every window in this station. It's engulfing the place. It's everywhere. Okay. Uh, it's hilarious how she literally said, I'm going to meet you in the shuttle bay. <laughs> and now she says, you have to move after I literally went to the shuttle bay. Makes no sense. I can't move. Okay. I don't have many heals left because I've been fucking around too much. Hopefully we don't need them. Oh, was weird that despawn. Oh no, not your bullshit. There are enemies here. Let me hack it. Help me. I hear a poltergeist. No fucking way. Yeah, I don't care about that guy. Where are you? There you are. Did it die? I did. Are there two? Oh, 
I'm leaving. Fuck this. A weaver. No. No. Reload. Oh, man. Where anyth anything is better than a technopath, dude. Fuck technopaths. Yeah, my face. Warning, dangerous level of explosive gas detected. Please be back to the oh. end of all. <laughs> I got the gas in here. Oh, uh, let's just skip all the enemies. I'm fast as fuck. Except for you. Fuck you. That's my food. Dangerous level of explosive gas detected. Please evacuate and avoid all open flames or sparks. We just passed out immediately. I'm dead. You better do something. The reconstruction is destabilizing. They're lying to you. Okay. Good work. The reactor's primed and capable of delivering close to 30 megatons. More than enough. I'll meet you on the bridge for the last part. Hurry, Morgan. There won't be anything left to detonate if we're too late. Is this a recycler? I guess I don't need to really fabricate anything else. Oh, we gotta get back. I hate moving up the shit, man. Oh, shit. It's good, man. You got Popeyes? Hell yeah, bro. Oh my god, what was that? What the fuck just hit me? Hello? Hello? What hit me for a hundred plus? That was crazy. I gotta get up there. It's like no easy way up. Okay. Gotta do the parkour shit again. What? Okay, now what? Go here. 
And then... And then what? Oh my god. Devs, I hate your parkour room. Fuck off, man. It's so dumb. Why is it not a fucking elevator just to go up? Yeah, man. No, just uh, awkwardly climb this whole thing. Yeah. The great decision. What is ha- Oh my god, get up there. Okay. Now, fucking quick save because this is pure AIDS. Dude, climb it, you fucking degenerate. Do it. Oh my god. Oh, I hate this. So much. Okay. Uh huh. Now what, dude? Just randomly climb on some glue you shoot. That'll be enough for the player. Oh, yeah. I just slid off. Holy fuck, this sucks. Sucks so much fat cock. I fell off. Fuck you, man. Ah! This is horrible. Get your fucking gun out. Alright, man, just glue everything. Glue it all. Holy shit. Oh, it's not over. Okay. Uh-huh. I guess we go here. Dumbest room in the game by far. Dumbest room in the game. Get me the fuck out of here. Alright. So, from here, can we do the two endings? Is Doll gonna call me from the fucking shuttle 30 hours later? Maybe I can help you. Let's save. Warning. Dangerous level of explosive gas detected. Please evacuate and avoid all... How did get up here last time? ...sparks until repairs can be made. Warning. Dangerous oh level God. of ex warning. Dangerous level of explosive warning. gas detected. Warning. And avoid we get it. All open warnings or dangerous Thanks level of explosive Thanks for that. Gas detected. Please evacuate warning. and avoid all... Warning, 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 warning. Okay, we have like no health. Um Still waiting for these idiots to contact me. <sighs> Shouldn't have to do too much else. Hopefully, we're just good. We can finally beat the game without a million parkour segments. Another Coulter, guys. Suck my dick. Nope. Not fighting it. Ain't doing it. Okay, they have to contact me here, because this is w one room to the shuttle bay and one room to the bridge, right? So if they don't say shit, I don't know how to do that ending. Really, they're not going to say anything. Oh, 
Oh, we actually have to, maybe we have to actually activate it. Where are we going for that? Okay. Just in case, this manual save. Oh man. Yeah, I love loading screens. So good. Oh, this electrical thing's gonna fucking kill me. No way it reaches me way up here, right? It'd be fucking dumb. This thing's gonna kill me, though. Turn. Oh my god. Maybe you have to do the null wave to escape on the shuttle. We're gonna do that next anyways. Fuck it, let's just blow this shit up. Wrong way, of course. Maybe. I, I see a person who looks like Morgan, you. Morgan, be cautious. Your brother is unstable. He may not permit you to activate the self-destruct. Also, he's armed. Unstable? Is that a joke, Operator? You've let this machine poison you. I wish you understood. I've bent the course of this entire station around what you wanted. I let you persuade me. And now you're gonna throw it all away? Just stop and think for one goddamn second, Morgan. The safety is off on his firearm. I think you've said enough. Oh! I never harm you, Morgan. Never. This machine, it had your voice. I knew from the video you'd done something with operators, but this? It's not too late, you know. We can still salvage this. You change your mind once, you can change it again. I won't stop you if you decide to end it all. I told you I wouldn't. So, what's it gonna be? Uh. Warning, reactor detonation imminent. What does he say? What does he say? <laughs> I wish there was something I could have said to snap you out of this. Fugue. It's my fault. I gambled too much. And the worst part? It isn't losing the station or the tech. It's you. You gotta I settle, lost man. My brother. That is a mistake I will never recover from. There's nothing left to talk about. Okay. Evacuate Talos 1. The shuttle is ready to go, Morgan. I'll wait a few minutes before detonation, but then I'm gone. You're on your own after that. All right. So you have to do the. Let's just do this. Well, we killed him, whatever. Let's go and actually blow up the place.
And we could escape. We could die. But we could escape on the shuttle, so why would we just stay here and die willingly? And then we'll do the ending where we don't kill him. We actually kill January. And then we use the null wave to preserve all the research. And I think we can... Maybe we can escape on the shuttle that way. Also. We gotta go to the lobby. Where the fuck am I right now? Can't even tell, dude. Jesus. Okay. Fly over the electric bullshit. Warning. Reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate Talos 1. Hello. Are you here for an appointment? So pretty much doing the January ending with with January. Hold on, maybe we should have killed Alex before. I guess it doesn't matter though. I wonder if letting January live matters, because he just wants me to blow up the station anyways. Well, actually, okay. Let's see what happens. Where, where's my quick save? Let's, uh, let's kill Alex. <laughs> and let January live. We've been pro-January the entire playthrough. But I think the ending's the same regardless. Who? What? Morgan. Morgan? <laughs> Morgan. Everything is ready. <laughs> now that the keys are armed, the order to execute is given from Captain Mark's terminal. I'm not able to execute. That responsibility is yours. What if I a want question. to? Is Morgan Yu capable of empathy beyond a small circle of interest? I'm only an operator facsimile. I cannot do it for you. What is this? Remote detonate scuttle charges. Huh? What's that quest we just did? The shuttle Advent left Talos with five crew aboard and is heading for Earth. There's a good chance they're carrying Typhon, so we just killed him. Oh my god, dude. Wait, no. Was that the shuttle I was going to leave on? I don't know. Morning. Reactor detonation. It's finished. All the directives you gave me have been completed. Next and final topic. Your mind is free of significant Typhon neuromods. It is. I believe the risk you pose to Earth is minimal. However, uh -huh. despite my belief, I cannot act against my directives. On the other hand, if I were to suffer irreparable system damage, I would be unable to interfere with your escape. Alternatively, you could depart with your colleagues aboard Dahl's shuttle. You didn't anticipate that outcome. I just uh -huh. wanted you to know that. Goodbye, Morgan. Goodbye, Morgan. I'll stay. The blast will annihilate me. Go, Morgan. I'll wait a few minutes before detonation, but then I'm gone. You're on okay. your own after that. Alright, I feel like that's the, the pro January ending right there. And we yeah, he's right. We didn't do a single Typhon Neuromod upgrade whatsoever. So technically we're bringing nothing back to Earth. We're destroying everything. So our Earth is safe.
Microgravity detected. I just need to not fucking die on the way there. Should make it in time. We just go to lobby and then shuttle bay. God damn it. Imminent. Fucking go, dude. Please evacuate Talos 1. Hello. What a crazy game, man. Crazy as fuck. Although I will say, I wish the Indians, because I remember the Indians. I've beaten this before. I wish the Indians were different but the core game is pretty good okay lobby let's get the hell out of here warning reactor detonation imminent please evacuate talos one Funny if there's a nightmare chilling here. We're free. We've already killed the enemies here too. Oh, now the bridge is extended. Yeah, of course. Warning, reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate Talos 1. Yeah, everyone's here. You made it. Look, I know what happened. You aren't solely to blame. You helped me and my officers when we needed it. Damn, she's the only I'll one that sure made it. Are sure to let Earthside know what you did to help us in the cargo bay? Cargo hole. Oh, this Warning. there's Reactor actually people in there. Okay. Please, Please take your seat. Talos one. What if we just wait here? I want a quick save. I didn't come all this way to die now, Morgan. Put your ass in that seat. <laughs> I'm gonna go take a piss. I'll be back. Are you <laughs> I want to see what happens. Invitation? Mom was right. You hear that, Mom? You were right. But it was my decision. Morgan, we should go. What are we waiting for? Morning. Reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate Talos 1. Warning, reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate Talos 1. Reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate Talos 1. Warning, reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate Talos 1.
All right. We got a minute 40 left. <sighs> what do you guys have to say? Dr. Yu, Morgan, it was an honor to work with you on Talos. Uh-huh. And your brother. And thank you for retrieving Lightner's remains. Maya always loved the sound of his playing. Yeah. He couldn't let it die with the station. His was a rare gift, and his skill should be shared. Not only with me, but with others. Now come the fireworks. I hope there'll be enough. I believe you've made the right choice, Morgan. This station is proof of what happens when Tronstar conducts operations unchecked. If the research survives, then the crimes here will continue, and these aliens? If even one survives, they'll escape again. And It'd be again. a shame if we sat here I for 41 more seconds. Some trace of my father. I wonder if there's supposed to be a fourth person here. I wonder if I could have saved. Well, hell, you could have had six, I guess. Dollar just doesn't even say anything to me. Warning. Reactor detonation imminent. Please evacuate Talos 1. <laughs> They're all against me right now. They all hate me. Oh my god, we just get in there anyways. Fuck. I thought we were gonna blow up and die. Ready or not, starting debark operations. Pre-flight check is who gives a shit. Hang on to your seat. This will be a rough ride. We made it. This is one FPS cutscene right here. My god. I keep having this dream. I keep having this dream, he said. Huh? Oh, it's more. It's finished. I killed you. How did it do? Activation of the mirror neurons is promising. Empathy quotient shows to be exceptionally high. It probably thinks it was dreaming. And nothing mattered. Uh-huh. You're assuming it thinks like us. Its life depends on it. Ours too. It oh, all phantom. comes down Look to at the my, choices uh... it made. It saved me from the cargo container. I would have suffocated otherwise, and later, it recovered the Lightner Connectomes. They were of no practical use, except that they were deeply meaningful to me. It's remarkable that it never installed a single Typhon-based Neuromod. In my nope. view, this demonstrates a strong identification with us, but its most surprising act was sparing Da. While perhaps for purely selfish reasons, this, at least in principle, enabled others to escape Talos Y. Michaela. As me. I would have died without my medication. That wasn't easy. That says a lot, I think, about its heart. Can I say that it has a heart? Then, there was a man in psychotronics. Ingram. That was cruel. There was no other way to see it. But oh, the guy in the cage. Yeah. <laughs> would you let it live? Yes. Sarah, on next. this side. The situation in the cargo bay was bad. None of us would have survived without its help. And it destroyed a large number of Typhon across the station. That has to be a good sign. Further, it thwarted Dar's attempt to use us as hostages. If it were one of my officers, I would give it a commendation. Danielle, what do you say? It found me. 
It didn't need to, but it did. By then, it had already stopped Volunteer 37. Hard to say why. A lot of humans controlled by the Typhon ended up dead. Not that it was easy to avoid, but I think it's worth the risk. Alex, it killed you. Back then, her would have done the same thing to me. In the end, it chose to destroy Talos One. Why? To protect Earth? We can't really know what its motives were for anything it did. But we have to make a choice. You can hear us, can't you? Here. I want to show you something. So everything was good except for the ending, so let's do the Null Wave ending and see what they say. Or like if it's any different. What you experienced was a reconstruction based on Morgan's memories. This is the world today. We spent years Locked. trying to put what you can do into us. We never tried putting what we can do into you. Until now. You're the bridge between our species. I need to know if you see us. I mean, really see us. Take my hand if you do. Kill them all, take Alex's hand. I mean, we're trying to do good, uh, good ending, right? Well, let's do, we'll take Alex's hand when we preserve all the research. Let's kill them all. I don't, I don't understand. Ah! Oh, man. <laughs> That's just the end. You finish, Bray. Lowest difficulty, hard. Oh, yeah, we did switch to Nightmare. We started on hard, and it was too easy, so I switched. Typhon Empowers, Human Bells. Neuromods installed 130. Humans killed 7. Rescued humans, 8. I guess, okay, I guess you can rescue 15 or something. The same abrupt ending. So that's kind of bullshit. I hated that because um, everything was fake, right? Literally everything was fake in the end. It doesn't matter because I, I, there is no way the Typhon could have got back to Earth. Zero way with what I did right there. Uh, we destroyed literally everything. We destroyed everything. There was no Typhon anywhere. And we still just get that ending, so... That was kind of a bummer, but it is what it is. As I said, the main game is really good, like the core gameplay and the story up to the ending uh, is really good in my opinion, but nothing matters, and I hate that. I hate games that do that to you. Choices matter, by the way, but they actually fucking don't. Um, so, we're lowering the quick save. We're gonna kill January, leave Alex alive. Uh, and then do the null wave. We're gonna be on Alex's side, basically. And then we'll probably wrap it up with Prey and move on. Um, I am gonna do another playthrough of this. Not right after this. It's gonna be a little bit. I need to take some time between playthroughs, because I think I'll get burnt out. But next time I play this, I want to do Typhon-only run. I only learn Typhon mods. I'm full fucking alien. Um, oh, my bad. Can I leave? No, they don't even let you leave. Okay. It's a wrong one. Want to go to where Alex and January are in the same room. Do we still kill this? I don't think it matters. Well, actually, no. But then, well, I mean, that counts as killing humans, right? Yeah, whatever. It doesn't matter. Oh, this is the wrong save anyways. Who 
Who? Morgan. 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 I would never harm you, Morgan. Never. This machine, it had your voice. I knew from the video you'd done something with operators, but this? It's not too late, you know. We can still salvage this. You change your mind once, you can change it again. I won't stop you if you decide to end it all. I told you I wouldn't. So, what's it gonna be? It's not too late. We all can right. still turn this around. The prototype no wave device will work, but you have to hurry. All right, so let's assume we, we just got persuaded by Alex. Let's pretend. Um, we're going to Psychotronics. Might die on the way there. I literally have no heals because I had just been making dumb decisions and not like quick loading. But yeah, we're literally preserving all the research this way. Um, Michael gravity detected. So we're in the lobby, we're going to Psychotronics, which is lower right, I think. I already made the null wave thing. I think I created it already. <clears throat> Let's see. Yeah. What was the point of this thing? I like got that for no reason. So weird to see like couches in a uh, an elevator. Disable the operators before they can fire. Yeah. Dude, they fire immediately. And take him, getting behind cover doesn't help because they just fly towards you. Uh, let's use my last med kit. We'll quick save here. Uh, how do we get up from here? Oh. Here, Poltergeist already. Fuck me. Get out of the way. Running pussy. Get out of here. Forget which door you have to go through. Requesting new operator. 
I guess the other way. to scan it. a fucking door man god damn it did that auto save fuck you man that should do it come to the bridge we can finish this thing once and for all so fucking stupid i hate this door it's just dog shit enemy ever can't run by most enemies. Especially with that speed upgrade. Uh, the bridge, which is up here. Alright, we'll see if they accept me. Uh, so what do we do? We Good just... Evening, Talos. How do we We'd escape? Like the shuttle? The company policy requires you to log any voluntary extension of your work hours with the station counselor. We know the projects aboard Talos 1 are exciting, but even the brightest minds need adequate rest. Microgravity detected. Hello, good to see you again, Doctor You. God, I hate zero gravity so much. Go above the electric bullshit. I'm totally gonna have to look at a speed run. You can, I think you can break the fuck out of this game with a glue gun alone. You can like just hit yourself and push yourself out of bounds, unless they patched it, but. I guess speedrunners usually go for old uh, versions of the game anyways, because usually the older it is, the uh, the more shit you can do, the more broken it is. Alright, here we go. What 
is a neuromod? Well, it's both an easy answer and a complicated one at the same time. It is the future, today. And more importantly, our past, today. This is the work Transtar does, every employee working together. It's immortality. It's and beautiful. It is beautiful. So we'll, we'll take his hand this time. I didn't kill him, so it should be like positive from all of them, right? It's finished. How did it do? Activation of the mirror neurons is promising. Empathy quotient shows to be exceptionally high. It probably thinks it was dreaming, and nothing mattered. You're assuming it thinks like us. Its life depends on it. Ours too. It all comes down to the choices it made. It saved me from the cargo container. I would have suffocated otherwise, and later it yeah, recovered the lightning the yeah. <laughs> They were of no practical use, except that they were deeply meaningful to me. It's remarkable that it never installed a single Typhon-based neuromod. In my view, this demonstrates a strong identification with us, but its most surprising act was sparing Da. While perhaps for purely selfish reasons, this, at least in principle, enabled others to escape Dalos One. Michaela. I would have died without my medication. That wasn't easy. That says a lot, I think, about its heart. We're gonna be so evil next playthrough. Oh my god. I'm gonna kill everybody. There was a man in psychotronics. Ingram. That was cruel. There was no other way to see it. But... Well, the guy was a fucking offender anyways. He did some fucked up shit. Yes. Sarah, you're next. The situation in the cargo bay was bad. None of us would have survived without its help. And it destroyed a large number of Typhon across the station. That has to be a good sign. Further, it thwarted Dar's attempt to use us as hostages. If it were one of my officers, I would give it a commendation. Danielle, what do you say? It found me. It didn't need to, but it did. By then, it had already stopped Volunteer 37. Hard to say why. A lot of humans controlled by the Titan. I wonder where this room dead. actually is. Not that it was easy to avoid, but I think it's worth the risk. In the end, he chose to activate the Null Wave device. Why? To preserve the Typhoon technology? We can't really know what its motives were for anything it did. Oh. We have to make a choice. No, that wasn't really you positive, can huh? Us, can't you? Here. I want to show you something. What you experienced was a reconstruction based on Morgan's memories. This is the world today. Uh huh. No matter what choices you, you make, the outcomes to put the same. Can do into <laughs> us. So dark shit. We never tried that. putting what we can do into you. Until now, you're the bridge between our species. I need to know if you see us. I mean, really see I'm us. tempted to kill him again, but I won't. <laughs> Take my hand if you do. We're gonna shake things up. Like old times. Oh, my hand turned... Kind of like a human. And that's just the end anyway. So it really just doesn't matter what you do. And that was my big thing with this game, like... I hate fake choices in video games. I hate it. I hate that the outcome is more or less the same. Same with Telltale games or stuff like that. I want a game where your choices actually fucking matter, dude. Actually matter. That would be fantastic.
But other than that, the game is great. Typical Bethesda game. You got bu you got the bugs, you got the glitches, you got the enemies, you got the loot, you got the upgrades and shit, the inventory system. Uh, this was great. I I, I love I love this game the first time I played it. Uh, even though the ending's dog shit, uh, I still thoroughly enjoyed. I like that there's multiple ways to do everything. It was like a little bit of Bioshock as well with the abilities and shit. Um, I messed around with some type of ab abilities back in the day, but I don't entirely remember. There's a bunch of them, dude. Um, so next time I do play this, Typhon only gonna be evil as shit. Kill everybody. Uh, it's, that's what's gonna happen. Um, but I don't know when that's gonna be. Uh, today is Halloween, the last day of doing horror games. Maybe I'll do this next, uh, October and you know, so it's around 16 hours. Nice. Um, but yeah, good game, good game. Oh, they also had the DLC. I don't remember if I played this. I think I did, but it was kind of meh when it first came out, so I was like, man. So I guess we'll do New Game Plus also our next, uh... Wait... So New Game Plus isn't worth it because I don't want human abilities. I want... I mean, unless we want to be OP as shit. We could be OP as shit. And have both human and... Typhon abilities. Maybe I'll do it. Fuck it. Maybe I'll do it. They also have survival modes. Weapon degradation, traumas. Suit damage causes air to leak from your suit, limiting the air supply in environments with no atmosphere. That's fine. Maybe I'll try it with this next, all, all the survival stuff too. Um, we could check this out real quick. I believe I do have it installed and ready to go. I believe this was like a survival thing. Hmm. Mooncrash is everything you love and pray. Both well, an exciting twist and Mooncrash will be able, you'll be making repeated runs through an ever changing simulation and moon base. Each run will present new combination of enemies, hazards, and loot. You might die a lot, but you also grow stronger and unlock new characters and gear to face these challenges. Let's, uh, let's check it out. The satellite. Does it have a difficulty or no? So kind of like a roguelike? Roguelite, whatever. Basilisk. Hello. This is Basilisk to Gasmo Module 13. We are sending two classified pieces of technology we recovered from Transtar's moon base. They should be arriving in a few moments. One is an operator containing a backup of the base. It's a simulation of all the research data, company secrets, and connectomes from employed brains. We picked you because it's protected by a lot of encryption. Fortunately, it comes with a looking glass visor, so you'll be able to search the sim visually. You'll be plugging into the moon base as it was, seeing it through the personnel that was stationed there. There's a lot yeah. to do. I'm sending you orders along so you can check them off as you go. Oh, and congratulations. I am pleased to inform you that executing these orders will fulfill your contract. After you recover the data, we're going to pick you up. So great news. You'll be with family soon. All right. Blah, blah, blah. We can we... Okay, M13, you're the expert. The delivery is jogging now, so I'll leave you to it. Transport craft African V KTL 17 commencing docking procedure. Please stand by to receive payload. Yes, we're going to install the simulation visor on the satellite chair.
Uh, default T Ration Psy Hypo. Ability progress, or he has some Typhon abilities. All right, well, the only character we have. Objective escape the moon. Story objective escape with a volunteer through the mimic portal to unlock their story objective. Through the mimic portal. Hmm. Well then. Attention all Titan's crew members. This is an emergency broadcast. Please report to designated escape pod stations and prepare for evacuation. If you are unable to reach an escape pod. Alright, so what do I got? It's a heal, I guess. Will track your position as it you is a heal. A final sweep before launching. Typhon material detected. detected. Yeah, here. Typhon material detected. Oh, oh. How do we use this? Uh, alien abilities. Bro, I am dead. What? I don't know how to use alien abilities, motherfucker. Fucking tell me. Eat shit, man. Hey, okay, I know you're supposed to die and upgrade, whatever, but like a thermal mimic? Okay, now all of a sudden we have a pistol. All right. Now I can fucking defend myself. That was fucking lame, dude. Like three enemies off the rip the first room you go into. You could fuck yourself. Come on. Let's go. Ugh. Piss me off. Come on, just fucking let me play, Jesus, okay. Okay, I have nothing. We, so how was I supposed to survive that? You're literally supposed to die, that's dog shit. The first room too. My game just, my game's frozen. Alright, man. Well, that's the end of Prey. I'm not gonna load the whole game up again. Uh, we didn't really get to experience the DLC, because they literally killed me the very first fucking room with four enemies. Thermal Mimics. What, what was I supposed to do? Um, but yeah, GG to Prey. I like the main story. DLC, I don't know if it's good or not, but I'm not. I don't feel like rebooting the game and going through a million loading screens to fucking play again. Um, yeah, we're gonna switch it up. But yeah, ne next time I play this, Typhon only mode in the main story, and I am going to kill everybody on New Game Plus. That is that is the plan. Sucks it froze, though. Can I even end the process? Jesus, dude. Not responding. End it, bitch. All right, GG.